Hello everybody, I'm SammyFackerBad.net and today we're going to be talking about hacked game accounts. How can you get back an account in a game that was hacked, that somebody got control of, you can't get into it at the moment. How do you get it back? How do you get back your stuff on the account and so on? So, very first thing, very basic thing to understand, very important to understand is that whenever an account gets hacked, usually what happened is not that some uh, mad genius hacker uh, found out your email and your password through uh, brute forcing or whatever. Uh, what usually happens is something like this, okay? You were maybe just a little, little bit naive and gave someone your username in a game or your email address and you were like, oh, yeah, I can enter my email address. It's not a problem, right? It's dankmemes at, at gmail.com. There you go. I get free gems in my favorite online game. Generate it. Please give me, okay? So this is usually how people get your stuff. Some of these scam websites will ask actually for your your password as well and some other ones might just try some brute forcing techniques because a lot of people are using very common passwords such as one two three four five six seven or um q w e r t or whatever so anyways there's just a few passwords that a lot of people are using they're very easy to get into and therefore you should never give anyone ever 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 your account name your email address or your password ever you should also never use the same password for your email account as you are using for your game account that's a huge huge mistake because if, if you use one of these generators that scam you all of them by the way um, and you enter your password, they get your password for your game account. But if you're using the same password for your email, obviously they're going to get your email as well. So that is the worst case scenario, right? Now, this is what will happen to a lot of people. Now, how do you get back your game account? Okay, so to get back your game account, you need your email account. Now, the question is, is your email account hacked as well? Because if the hacker wants to change the email on your game account, he will need control of your email account. All right. So the first step will always have to be to get back your email account. All right. That's the first step. Make sure you are in control of your email account. If you're using the same password on your email account as on your game account, then go to your email account ASAP right now. Okay and change that password if the hacker has not control of it yet. Go into your security settings and uh, make sure that no one else is locked into your account. Uh, end all the sessions. Change the password. End all the sessions that they are in your email account to just make sure if you can put two-factor authentication on your email account as well so that nobody can get into that one. Okay, very important. <laughs> And that's always the safest way to go if you want to make sure you don't get hacked is two-factor two authentication. Someone would have to actually get control of your phone as well to hack that one. So, please guys, and keep in mind, usually in like 99% of cases, when someone gets hacked, they are the ones that actually gave away their information and not it, the hacker was not the genius that just hacked into it somehow okay there's a lot of these scam and generators scam tools scam whatever where they're asking for your email and your password and a lot of people fall for it anyways so first you get your email now if the hacker has control of your email all right here is what you do if you have gmail a lot of people will have gmail it's very easy to get back your account you just go for let's say dankmemes at gmail.com is my email address right Go to forgot password and then they will ask you for several things, you know, enter the last password you remember. Uh, maybe they'll ask you for a security question. They'll ask you when you created the account. You don't have to give them the exact date. Just enter um, some about, you know, if you know it was like three years ago, enter three years ago. In this case, that would be 2000 and what would it be? 14, right? So just give as close as you can get of an answer they'll ask you for your phone number if you have one connected they'll ask you for the security email the recovery email um, they'll ask you for you 
all kinds of things, uh, information about your account, okay, that only you would know, all right. Um, just this kind of stuff, and it's it's very good with Gmail, other services such as Hotmail, and other email services. It's not quite as good. Uh, like with Google with Gmail, your chances of getting your account back if you are the actual owner of the account, okay? The, your chances of getting it back is like 95%. All right. Even if someone puts two-factor authentication on there, if you know all the information and your IP address is correct and you can answer all these questions, they'll just re-roll all those changes and you'll get complete control of your account. All right. So that is very important. Google also remembers all your past uh, security emails, your past phone numbers, and so on. So it's very good. Other email services, um, the really primitive ones, you might just be screwed. Okay, Yahoo, you'll probably get back. Hotmail, you'll probably get back. Um, but Gmail is is definitely the safest option. So if you want a, an account, an email account that you'll always get back, go for Gmail. All right, <laughs> it's it's the safest option. It's, it's also what all the scammers use when they're like, I'm selling you an account, I'm giving you the Gmail address, and then they after a year they come and get back the account and scam you. Anyways, doesn't matter. That's just a little gripe that I have. Anyways, that's how I learned that, by the way. Now, <clears throat> once you have your email account and you're in 100% control it's not using the same password as your game account okay that is when you use the email account that was connected to your game okay that you just got back or that you are now in full control of to email support support email okay you need not a ticket not anything like that you search the support email for your game okay so I'm just gonna go to Google and for Clash of Clans, for example, Clash of Clans support email, okay, address, okay, you need an email address, very, very important, so in this case, the email address would be, hmm, it's kind of, kind of difficult to find out, isn't it, um, here you go, uh, in this case, it would be Clash of Clans Feedbacks at Supercell.net. You need to have an email address, okay? Since you can't log into the game and use the ticket system, you need a support email address. Every game has one, okay? Every game has one. And if you can't, uh, if the game doesn't have one, then find one for the developers. In this case, that would be Supercell, right? So you would go for Supercell uh, uh, support email right it's very important because you can't use the ticket system and because your account got hacked you need an email address and you need to email them using the email ac address connected to your account that way they see oh this is the email address of the original owner yes um, this is the original owner of the account and if someone if the hacker changed the email address connected to the account they'll see that most decent games will have a history of connected email addresses and, and they'll be able to figure out that this game that this game account was hacked and that someone changed the email on it all right they'll have a log of that so that's very important so let's let's just re recap First, get back your email account. If you still have your email account, make sure it's safe. Make sure you're using a different password than your game account. Two, find the email address of the developers of the game. Use Google. Use your intellect. Use your brain. You're an intelligent person. You can do this. Okay. Find an email address. An email address is something at something dot something. Okay. Get that. Send the support team an email. Tell them your account got hacked. Someone got uh, access to it. Um, you want to get it back, okay? Tell them that. Step three, you need to wait. You're at the mercy of the support team now, all right? That is, uh, that is just what it's about. Now, if a game has a bad support team and they take weeks to respond or whatever, that sucks. There's nothing you can do about it. There's nothing you can do about it. You're going to have to wait. And you're going to have to rely on, uh, you know, usually with big games, um, support teams will get this every day. Like, I'm sure millions of Clash of Clans accounts get hacked every month so or, or every year. So, you know, with the bigger games, they'll have a lot of experience with this and they'll be able to help you. It's not going to be a problem. Also important, if you're, 
using different computers or different whatever uh, to access your game, send them an email and only uh, um, go to their help desk if they, if they give you a link using the IP address that you use to play the game. They'll be able to verify that way as well that you're the original player. So that's important as well. Yeah, and that's how you do it. Okay, let's go through it again. First, make sure you have your email account. Then send a, an, e an email to the support team of the game. Tell them you got hacked and then wait for the support team. And they will be able to give you back your account. Now, you might ask, well, they stole stuff from me, right? Let's say they stole your gold or whatever if there's trading in a game. Yeah, um, sometimes support can help you with that and they might re-roll that, but I wouldn't trust it. I wouldn't trust it because that would enable people to scam support by just, you know, acting as if they got hacked and giving, selling their stuff and then for real life money or whatever and then uh, going to support and t telling them they got hacked to get back their stuff. So, um, I wouldn't try, but, you know, you do you. You do you. And very important now at the end, guys, don't fall for these scams. There are no online game money hacks, okay? There are not, right? There isn't. doesn't happen. Why, you might ask? Because if a game, an online game, such as, you know, your Clash of Clans, your uh, Clash Royale, your huge mobile and non-mobile online games, uh, whatever overwatch or whatever if there was a money hack for any of these or a god mode or whatever uh, The developers would stop making money. Okay, if there was just a, a, a gem hack for clash of clans That was as simple as this. Okay, if you could just enter your name and get unlimited gems Which is what the developers sell to make money if that was possible the developers wouldn't make money anymore at all, okay? So what, what actually happens if somebody figures out, out an exploit to get gems in a, in a mobile game, for example, or whatever kind of money, uh, developers notice that extremely quickly because A, they're making less money, B, it's going viral among the players, C, there's people that have a billion gems on their account. That's not normal. So what usually happens is they shut down their servers right there, right then. They re-roll the last 24 hours or however long it's been going on. Uh, so everyone who has cheated using a method will lose anything they cheated, they hacked. And yeah, and they patch the problem. And then it's not going to happen again. Okay, so <laughs> that's how it actually works in reality. Money doesn't grow on trees. You don't get free everything. Not in online games. In single player games, this kind of stuff works because you have all the data on your phone, on your PC, on your device, right? Uh, but not on online games. Online games are very, very different. Those are the servers of the developers, computers that they control. It's not going to happen. Please never give anyone your email address. Never give anyone your login information, none of your login information, especially, and never, guys, never use the same password on your game account and on your email account. Never, never, never do that, because if someone gets your email account, they could potentially keep your game account forever, okay? If, if you don't know how to get back your email account using the forgot pass, password or whatever, uh, you're, you might be screwed, or if you have a, an email... Uh, provider that doesn't have those options, right? And then you might be screwed, absolutely screwed. Also, if you can't see these forgot email and forgot whatever options, go on, go on a PC, okay? If the mobile version doesn't show you these things or if it's harder on the mobile version, go to a PC and do it there, okay? So that's how you get back your game account. I would say in 99% of cases you'll get back your game account. Um, in 50% of cases you might get back the stuff that got stolen. Because it's usually games where stuff can be stolen. Uh, where this kind of stuff happens or they'll try to sell your account or whatever. So anyways guys, it's a dirty business and this is just a basic knowledge that you have to know. 
and please don't give anyone your data. It's it's, it's bad. Okay, don't, it doesn't matter what they promise you. If they promise you a girlfriend generator, please st still don't give them your data. <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, this is just basically a video that I can link people to when they're asking me this kind of stuff, so that everybody knows how to get their account back if it gets hacked. Anyways, guys, thanks you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later.